Hello everybody and welcome to Pre-Connect. Today, it's wonderful to have you all. I'm so conscious uh, and so grateful to the Holy Spirit for giving me this consciousness. It's like a growing consciousness that every time I minister to you, um, uh, it, it, it's, it, it's like I'm there with you. And uh, it's uh, very precious to me because we really do miss you. We do really do long to see your faces. And so to experience the Holy Spirit like this in my heart, making up the difference, and that our hearts can be knit together like this in the Spirit, that we can really experience, and that's what I'm experiencing when the Apostle Paul said, I will be with you in spirit. To actually be experiencing that, that I really am with you, heritage of faith prayers in spirit, as we pray together. And um, so we're going to just start with prayer together for our nation. We're so grateful to God that he's working and he doesn't delay help on our behalf. That when we come to him, Luke 18, and we continue to plead our case before him and we, 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 we don't grow weary and we don't faint and we don't turn coward and we don't give up and we continue that our God is not slow. He speedily comes to our rescue as we continue to plead our case before him. I really do, do we do just believe that together and it's just wonderful because it's part of our work and we're working and on working hours to have some of the, the interns in the, in the Prayer Connect group with me here in the studio. And uh, my uh, gratitude to the Lord for what he's doing in our president's life and in the ANC party of how he's putting men and women around our president that are supporting him, supporting his decisions, how grateful we are yeah. together in this time of prayer that our justice system is working yeah. at this time to bring justice. Yes. That we have men and women in our justice system yeah. that are upright, yes. that are upholding the law. Yes. How grateful I am to the Lord yes. that he's He's, that's part of him answering our prayer and removing people out of our justice system that are corrupt yeah. and bringing upright men and women into our legal processes so that justice can be upheld. Yes. Glory to God. We really do thank him and praise him for that. Hallelujah, hallelujah. We recognize that, Father. We acknowledge you at work, at work in all of the, of the places the corridors of power, as Pastor John puts it. And so today we come to pray for our president. When I come to pray for our president, I see his face. And I have this picture, you know, where he's sitting on a chair and I, uh, you know, and I see his shoulders and I see him and I just come and I put my hands, you know, he's, he's facing away from me, but I just come and put my hands on his shoulders because of everything that he's carrying, all the decisions he has to make, every, every difficulty, that he, every, everything that the enemy is throwing at him, but then all the wonderful things that he must, you know, decide and things that must, he must see and know and everything that I can just put my hands on his shoulders. That's how personal it is to me. That's really how much uh, love God, the Lord has put in my heart for him. Glory to God. And so the same Holy Spirit lives in you that can just put, have that same picture as me. So let's come now to pray for our president and just so to speak in the spirit, put our hands on his shoulders and pray for him and lift him up to the Lord. Thank you, Father. We pray now for our president, Cyril Ramaphosa. You have said that he must be the most prayed for president ever, Lord. His strategic significant things that he's got to do for you, Father. Yes. These answers that you are wanting to bring, therefore they are prayers that we must be praying, Father. So grateful are we to be praying in the Holy Ghost oh, yes. and having a complete mental bypass, Lord, that we don't have to understand what we are praying, but you immediately go to work 
you immediately, you, are, you know what we are saying because we speak in the tongues of men, uh, of the tongues of angels, Lord. Yes. We speak in the heavenly language that the Holy Spirit gives us utterance to speak to you, Father. Yes, so now we speak to you about our president and for our president and on his behalf. Kele pariga da pu shemene mara kude bedekteki shemene mara kure bredekteri shamana mara kure gedekteri imana mote kro prashi kro brisando brigado ai kude breshe erma koro shebre bere pariga da boreda ina mana katadi shaya lotre bi gru bi gru bi gru baro ei ya 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 yo brekereka ia lo se tre se karakaro. to our prayers, your, with supreme intelligence, with all of the wisdom. Thank you, Lord, that you multitask with our prayers. Our prayers enable you to be multifaceted in your answering, Lord, and you multiply, Father. Hallelujah. Glory, glory, glory. So now, Father, we're going to pray for the ANC party, Lord, all those men and women that are surrounding our president that are working together to govern South Africa, Lord. And we continue to ask you to set up and put down. Yes. Set up and put down. Yes. According to Daniel chapter 2 that we read last week, yes. we ask you, Father, yes. to do that in this party. <laughs> Thank you that you're doing it. Yes. Thank you that you're continuing to do it, Father. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. South Africa is spoken for by you, Jesus. According to Psalms 2, you, Father, said to Jesus, ask of me and give, I will give you the nations for your inheritance. So we know, Jesus, that you've asked for South Africa and that she is spoken for, Lord. And so we speak to you about her so that you can take her and you can do in South Africa. I remember 
in the church where we were planted that we grew up and we used to sing a song. I ask for South Africa. I call her by name. I present her to the Father in Jesus' name. And uh, we sang that song, a very beautiful song, but we call her by name today. South Africa, Lord. The land of most of us, the land of our birth, where you, Father, caused us to be birthed into the earth in this nation, Lord. What a privilege to be praying at this time in the earth for South Africa. So we pray for the ANC party right now. Two minutes. Come on, everybody. Shikarakatole, shabravasolo, prebeketako, amu reposinaka, ala kro de pefe shela krotoro pokoroda. Yes, tes tes te te trepte papala ture pere karadore mi. Yamara kato rosto doro doro mi. Mi mayamo, mi mayamo, kele kaniga rogote kete se shisala. Okrova kato, mem perende te kira kushke te fere brava solo koro pokrobo. She kere fara strove, kere para strove so. Ye kere kasikra stro. Me kele brava la broche, pre basta la broche. Ye kasala katra travoshke. Ye pere brabashka rakotre prekete halasto krokonteri. Isha frobelete ratu kushkoro foro kropo shere preveki. Ye mene kara kore preve kashka da kara kore kre kashka ro. Ira da kara kore dere de krash krava no. Dira da kara dure bere vedishka da krash ka ro. Dira da kara dure bere vedishka da in a Hallelujah. Thank you, Lord. Sometimes when I'm praying in the Holy Ghost, not all the time, I don't need that, but I do have an impression of what God is giving me to pray for. And uh, at this time in praying for the ANC, uh, I'm, I'm sharing this with you to bring you in an awareness of how specifically God can answer our prayers. He reminded me of uh, an, a, a, a person in the ANC and I was driving somewhere with Pastor John a few years ago and he said to me, it was very quiet in the car, and then he said to me, we, we lost a very good man in the ANC. He got taken out in a car accident, Sharon. And he spoke to me about this man, this upright man in the ANC, and how a pivotal point he was, you know. And so as I was praying, I just knew, I was praying for the protection of the good men and the good woman, that they will not be able to be taken out because we pray for them. We, because we hold the blood and we plead the blood and we speak the blood of Jesus, the protection of the good men and women that God has put into place, that they are untouchable because we surround them with the word and the blood of Jesus. So can we go just one minute together for the protection of the good men 
and women in, in government and in the, in, ju in the justice system and the good men and women in municipalities and the good men and women that have been divinely placed, that they, they'll not be able to be moved out by the enemy. One minute, everybody, in the power of agreement. them and their spouses and their children, Father, surrounded and protected by the word and the blood of Jesus. And many of these men and women are God's children. Hallelujah. That goodness that flows from them and their love for the country comes from the Lord in their hearts, you know. So we thank you for that, Father. So, Lord, now we pray for the opposition parties. And we say, we say thank you again that our prayers are preparative. They prepare. Our prayers are preventative. Our prayers are releasing things, Lord. And our prayers are restricting and constraining things too, Father. Hallelujah. In the opposition parties, Father, you know, you know, you know that the mouths of lions and you shut them, they'll not be able to bite. They'll not be able to take chunks out of this nation, Lord, because we pray for the opposition parties right now in Jesus name, in the power of agreement that you'll have your way and you have your say. Glory to God. Two minutes, everybody come. Let's pray together. Se prepara do shemente pravasalatu ketre prepashkato efre manakadu brigashose alakru tere fara broche ne makratira no iskara strafta ko ikala kote refe te la rapore pre ya kashala to ye pere para sone menekere sinta to ere pakisa na mote pera to ikara sofre pere tara no yalo ya ko da bravashku de bele. Koda brabisha na masta brogode, kode meves ene makravas ele perese de branco tu, kode fre ene makras to do proto roto ko. Nisha bro probos ke reves ele pakara dure mene ne nishka ta. Yes ele kato prebita sila kato korobos ke re. Shala brabos ke re se le katika to kotre preves ele para tu. Yene katika, yene katika to kole preves ele asta kata feroche. Imana Macro breve de bara sore pequeche de bala tu. E a no mostre pere para sore pequeche para sobre bere se le bara cure. Ai alô, tem uma. Yeah, 
Thank you, Lord, for all of that. You know, the Holy Spirit really helps us to continue to pray, you know. Uh, it's just wonderful to me that um, as, our, as we continue to press to pray, you know, the Lord will just give you that encouragement of uh, really what He can do with, with our prayers. It's amazing. Anyway, glory to God. Um, we're going to be praying now for our next president. Ha, this is very exciting for me every time we do this. Because <laughs> I'm, you know, we're all so aware together. Oh, yes, what I was going to say early on, this is where I wanted to go. While I was praying, I was, again, so aware that there are many of us praying in this prayer of agreement for the opposition parties. And so these prayers are going to work all week long. Yes. And God is going to, they're going straight into God's ears, straight into the, to, to the bowls of, at the throne of God. And angels go to work immediately. Angels are at this station in this nation. You know, we can, we, that, that was one of the things he said, continue to cast all your cares yes. about this nation because angels are at their station, yes. you know, and they're working with all the prayers. Just go and check again in the book of Revelation. If you're losing sight of that, go and see scripture again. They go to the throne and angels are immediately busy with them. Yes. Glory to God. Glory and then the angels that are at, at their station in this nation are working with God to, to effect actually answer these prayers. Praise God. Hallelujah. 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 Praise the Lord. Praise Praise the Lord. Glory to God. Glory to God. Hallelujah. 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 Glory. And so we're praying for our next president. We come to plead our case again. You know, uh, 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 we come to the judge of the whole earth to, to say to him, the right man, the next right man in power, Lord. <laughs> the next right man, whatever you have to do, here's us pleading our case on the basis of the blood, Lord. Yes, yes, on the basis yes. that South Africa is spoken for and she belongs yes. to Jesus, has already asked for the nation of South Africa. Yes. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. And so this nation belongs to him. So yes. God will have his way yes. and God will have his say in this yes. nation Amen. as long as the church will pray. Yes. As long as the church will pray with faith in their hearts and joy in believing that he's answering our prayer. So we pray, Father, now for our next president, Lord, you're rearranging, you're resetting, you're, 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 you're shifting, you're displacing, you're shaking, you're, you're just arranging and doing everything that you know how to do it so that the next president that comes into power, Lord, is the next right man. Hallelujah. 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 Hallelujah, Lord. Hallelujah. We can praise you in advance because yes. we come to pray now for this yes. to you with faith, Lord. Yes. Glory to God. Glory. And so here we go, all of us together, Father, all of us together for two minutes we pray for our next president, the next right man. Oh, 
of that word Pastor John had Jesus is the victor yes. for the destiny of this nation yes. Jesus is the victor yes. for the destiny of this nation yes. glory to God glory, glory to, God. to God and now we're just going to surround Brother Jerry oh our hearts immediately filled with this love for Brother Jerry and all of the challenges that he may be facing and we know that he is facing challenges because we know that the enemy strategizes to come against men and women that are on the front line that are sold out to God. Yes. It's just his nature. Yeah. He's a murderer. He's a thief. Jesus speaks much about him yeah. to his disciples. He's a liar. Yeah. And so, and he's a 24-7 active being. Mm -hmm. And so... You know, we're going to cover, we're going to plug up yes. any, every, anything that's around him at this time. Yes. Where, there, where there's maybe, you know, like on Nehemiah's wall, where there may be a, a, a gap there. Yes. We stand in the gap. Amen. Yes. Hallelujah. Yes. Strong for Brother Jerry yes. today. Yes. Whatever yes. he is going through, yes. whatever challenges he is facing. Yes. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Glory, 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 glory. We come against today. We come to resist with Brother Jerry because we know how he does it. We know how he does it when he is faced with a challenge, when the enemy, he knows he turns it, the test into a testimony. But we come to, together with him, together with him by the person of the Holy Spirit to surround him with yes. everything that he needs. Yes. Hallelujah. 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 Right now, Hallelujah. in the power of agreement, all of us, yes. Father, yes. all of us right now, yes. and we say, Father, yes. with the utterance of the Holy Spirit for Brother Jerry, Oh, Shapra <laughs> Bregando, 
Shempetikano, 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 Kuchokuletu, Pravishala Pro, Shempre, Pakilatu Krisa, Lompakitano, Lempekitano, Meshe Krisa, Shore, Yeshe Revaso, I just want to be a little bit more specific. I just need an amplified Bible. Thank you. Thank you so much, Danielle. Okay, I'm just going to find the scripture and we're going to pray it and then we're going to pray some more for Brother Jerry. We're going to just declare what we really do want today more of. I think it's Ephesians 3. Yes, yes, here it is. Here it is. This is what we ask of you, Father, in the power of the agreement of all of us praying at this time. May you grant, Brother Jerry, and we will just include Brother Joe in this as well, Amen. while we're about it. Yes. May you grant him out of the rich treasury of your glory yes. to be strengthened yes. and reinforced yes, with Amen. mighty power in the inner man. Yes, By the Holy Spirit himself indwelling Brother Jerry's innermost personality. Yes. May he have the power and be strong yes. to apprehend and grasp yes. what is the breadth and length and height and depth of your love yes. for him, Father. Yes. Hallelujah. 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 We ask, Father, that because of these prayers, we're praying for him, Father, that he may be filled through all his being unto all the fullness of Christ, that he may have the richest measure of your divine presence. And now at this time become a body wholly flooded and filled with you, yourself, God. This is what we are asking for him, Father. And to you, God, be the glory in the church because of what you're going to do through our prayers. And in Christ Jesus. Glory in this generation, yes. in this generation while he still lives on earth yes. for the purpose of his birth, Father, yes. that he will fully run his race. He will finish his course, Father. Yes. There will be nothing and no man and no adversary that will be able to stop your plans for his life yes. to fully fulfill them, Father. Yes. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Strengthened with mighty power in the inner man now, yes. Father. Yes. Holy flooded and filled with you yourself, yes. Father. Right now, Father, yes. until we pray for him again next week. Yes. Two minutes, everybody. Ayana <laughs> <laughs> 
We thank you, Father. 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 We give you thanks. We thank you. We thank you, Lord. Thank you, Lord. We thank you for Brother Jerry. We thank you for Brother Jerry, Lord. We thank you for his life that he has spent, that he is spending, Lord, on assignment, Father, for your church. Thank you for strengthening him, not just with mighty power in the inner man, but in his physical body, Lord, in his physical body, from the top of his head, Lord, to the soles of his feet, Father. Father, it's in our heart now, and we're going to go there. We're carrying him, bearing him up. I'm reminded of that scripture by you, on wings of prayer. We come to bring this big hearted spirit being in this little body, small of stature, but big of spirit, big of heart, Lord. We come, Father, to bring his physical body, Lord, and, and its full restoration, its full resetting, Lord. Father, Father, we come. Ishavole sunute, prepeshele salatore, recover. Let him be recovered in his in his physical body, in his cells, in his bones. Ishala krosa ne mekere beshke, in his yoshele mere krasa no moshke. Everywhere, Lord, yeshere prebeshka renewed, restored. Le prebeshke sina more prebeshke to his feet. Your kush go from his head to his feet. Ye kere ki sira bo, i mana kore bo. I shakro se neni maraton. Ye kesh kere parisha na mara kote pre. I shano do kote pe. Ye kere si prapo. Ye kere te si prapo. I saklore si na mo kere si no. Li krava talos te ne ni krado. I kau tu breve ne kishka do re breve ske do. I kau tu breve ne mana kobre. I shabro priba. Kodre, <laughs> Strobe ke le pravishka trisa, oh ya kala kotre, oh ya kala kotre, freve de kishka da barakute le pere kara no, shekele, shekele kele kerisa, oh brebere pasa, yeshke de vira krufe ne meshketa, yes Lord, yes Father, that his strength, his physical strength will not abate. as long as you have need of his vessel on the earth for assignment and the things that he must still complete, Father. Yes. We ask, we come on the basis of the covenant and the blood of the covenant yes. and healing and health yes. and well-being for us. Yes. 
His youth renewed like the eagle's father. Hallelujah. Thank you. In Jesus' name. Now we come to pray for Pastor John. In this time of God, in his personal process with God, in his execution for all things. And like I said last week, it, when I do come to pray for Pastor John, when we come to pray for Pastor John, it's the same sense that I have as I pray for the president of this nation. Because that scripture in Timothy says to pray for all the, those that are in positions of responsibility. All the leaders, and he is a leader, and he's in a position of great responsibility, great spiritual responsibility to execute everything in the natural too. You know, to be sensitizing himself continuously to the voice of the Holy Spirit so that he can be receiving concepts, insights and ideas from Jesus, the head of the church, through the mighty person of the Holy Spirit, you know, and that he can have continuous recognition of the time and be receiving instructions all the time, be giving instructions, be activating his obedience with boldness and the law of attraction. Of course, that is the attraction is that God's plans and purposes are attracted and come to pass. God himself is attracted to obedience. He comes when we obey. And so we thank you, Father, for this obedient vessel, Lord, that Pastor John has learned and continues to learn special act of obedience through what he suffers in his flesh, Father. Thank you, Father, that like the Apostle Paul, he too daily puts his flesh under, Lord, that he that scripture in the Amplified that says he boxes his flesh. He handles it roughly. He disciplines it every day, Father. Hallelujah. Because of his eyes that are set on things eternal, not things temporal, Father. Hallelujah. Thank you that you are, you are bringing him up higher spiritually, Father. His ears are hearing more. Blessed are his ears for they hear. His eyes, spiritual eyes are seeing more. Blessed are his eyes for they see. Hallelujah, Lord. Thank you for the spirit of seeing and knowing and then the full execution of everything. And there he keeps going and going, Lord, with being bold in you, Father, and being full of humility in you, Father, and bold and big in you and jumping and leaping and leaping Lord and lurching forward and moving ahead Father yes, hallelujah. Yes, hallelujah hallelujah we thank you Father at this time that you have need of this vessel to be obeying you and 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 you bringing all of the resources continuously we have so much to give you thanks and praise for Father of what you how you have provided for him Father but we continue to pray for him we continue to pray for him the responsibility that he has to hear you and obey you Hallelujah. Hallelujah. In this time, in this new era, we pray for him, Father, with our whole heart. Yeshefele Sakuri, me creve tala si crudu, ishavro perba, ma kandu bete revishara, ko bregish kara faruse de breke te para funde, ma na kana mone mene kaskadore vereka, ma na kana kure brevedere kere veshera, yasho, yasho. Pelte, 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 kele, kravakishka, ropa, tapata litu, shempetika, non tepetika, no peletafro, prika, tukulutuku, shere, pravashka tulepe, yepesheli, shukuskete falisha, labata katukte perebe, kalta krisho no krunitu, yakali krova, yakali krova, pakarature mere parasure preveta la kira kure pereka, yelema nikra kature breveshida. Yene me nikra prokeshke le freshke dala yala kule preveshke de palature fere prava sule kele du ana manakto kroshke tere vara su yemene maru yemene maru te kere fashalo prevele salo prevele salo kutukulu purapoti ya shavalaso ya shavalaso ke temte prashina mo ke revese la priska troboto pototo proboshke ya shavatala su te pekete la tapira profesele patako yala pakato no kutu yeah. I want to pray something very specific. I want to pray now. I want us all to pray now for Pastor John and I. Pastor John on the right side, myself at his side on the left, walking shoulder to shoulder 
in this new era with the new things that God has got for us to see and to walk in together. Yes. Right. Yes. Because it's all so new. Yeah. There are things that we have to see to know what to do. Yes. It's all very new in this new era. We cannot walk together as we have in the last era. It's a completely new era and it's God's new era. And Jesus says in the book of Revelations, Behold, I'll make all things new. He's making everything new. We can't even compare ourselves to how we were in the past to see if we're making progress or not. We can't we can't do what we did in the past and be walking together like we did in the past. In terms of pattern and principle of God's word, yes. But in terms of the new things that God has for us, we can't, we're not going to get stuck. We're going to know. We're going to put oil into this, the, 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 the mechanics of this, the spiritual mechanics of how this must be so that we walk into answered prayer. Hallelujah. Two minutes for this, very important for you all. You're praying for yourselves when you're praying for Pastor John and I Amen. to be doing this according to the excellence of God. She paracatu, shempre, matru, utru, preku, shakru, strefte, kalakute, pravanatu, kuturupa, shaparavasa, la tupe de pese, le mata kute pete, keravashune. Inamanako rote, mashavadaso, mashavadaso pere katalo, meshepe la santu, yo shepe le salano le santu, ipala shose de palas de shantu, ipala por sote, pala, stokole, le kele, pala shapro, Prevene maka rope tele se para tu, shemene mara shute le para kushke de para surepi, ya krujantu, yemene kara tu, nemene mara kara tu, yepeshe, yepeshepe, yo shika sulepe, ya shika la peleshe, yisha bo silepa, no pele vasilepa, kuta kute kula, lel bande libre mantra dosh gire fala strote para tu. Mi shabule se de brava kule pe kere mana to Ya na kratore pre gishkara mana karote kara katikara Ira katuke le brasta gadi kata Ya na mano rebe la kato rebe da basa lo kuro kudrente ki Ya broche no skriba broche domre drente Fala pro ele fala shana pro Pe se le frana pro ele mana karo Ye pe shere vala to ye ke shere Yes, it's a 
You come into a new era. Can I have the amplified, please? Thank you. Thank you, Danielle. You come into a new era and you've been just from a, a humanity point of view, you've been married 40 years. Just there's a familiarity when you've been married so long. And so God needs for all of the familiarity to dematerialize about each other. Because this is part of what the Apostle Paul talks about in Corinthians where he says, let, a married, let the married people be as if they were not married. So our prayers are for the wife things to be the wife things. The husband things to be the husband things, but the assignment things to be the assignment things. The gifts and callings, mantles and anointings that are on Pastor John or new legacy transfer things that are coming on him, that there be a recognition of him and of me. And then the same thing for me, that where we walk together in our giftings, calling so different, so different, both required, both desired, both needed for the Father God in the church at this time, for this time that we both can come up into the fullness and that's why familiarity has to dematerialize. And this will be done because we pray and we ask. And Pastor John desires it and I desire it, desire it and that Jesus will be able to make all things new. Reset in Pastor John. Reset. It's exactly what happened to Sarah and Abraham at that time of their life. They got reset when Isaac came. They had all this familiarity with each other for so long, but then Isaac came. And so that's what we pray. That God may fill Pastor John and I with a full knowledge of his will. I'm just going to go to that scripture to ask that. While we have this agreement here now, that as Pastor John and I walk shoulder to shoulder into this new era to lead God's people. Pastor John is the first, but I'm second, right? And so that we have an accurate recognition of what this is, must look like going into the new era, Amen. right? Amen. So here it is. We do not, we make special requests today for Pastor John and I that we may be filled with the full, deep, clear knowledge of your will yes. as we walk in together on assignment now yes. in all spiritual wisdom, Amen. in comprehensive insight into the ways and purposes of you, God. Yes. And in understanding and discernment of spiritual things so that Pastor John and I may walk and live and conduct ourselves right now in this new era in a manner worthy of the Lord, fully pleasing to Him, desiring to please Him in all things, bearing fruit in every good work and steadily growing and increasing in the knowledge of God, in the knowledge of you, God, with fuller, deeper, clearer insight, acquaintance and recognition. Glory, glory, glory in this new era. And so that's, we thank you for that, Father, for the power of these prayers now and the power of agreement. And now we're going to continue to pray for one another, according to Luke twenty-two thirty-two. that the faith, your faith, heritage of faith, people, my faith, it includes mine and it includes Pastor John's, not fail us, but that we come up in faith. In all things, yes. definitely God is putting an emphasis on that we come up in faith and health and healing yes. because spiritual activity is being increased. But that does not mean we let go of faith for provision, faith for protection, faith for relationships, faith for our, our assignment and our God's, pursuing God's plan for our lives. Yes. We don't let go of those. We're just putting an 
emphasis now. A new emphasis, adding a new emphasis on faith for healing and health. Hallelujah. So Father, we come now to pray for one another that we all come up in faith. And we thank you, Holy Spirit, that you are helping us in our faith. You are greatly assisting us, Father, as we search your scriptures, as we put our eyes on scriptures, Lord, that you inspire them. You make them come alive in us. And so we come up and we come up and we come up in faith. In Jesus' name, Father, as we give your word more attention than we have ever given before because faith comes by hearing your word, meditating on your word, not letting it depart from our eyes or from our heart, Father. We pray for one another right now. Come, everybody. Powerful praise now for two minutes. Shikala Katru, Prefeshela, Rasha Santruki, Hush Mashaba, Hush Mashaba, Hush Mashaba, Shusta Kataba, Hush Mashaba Salatia, Hush Kristikira Tiara, Oh, Katala, the Rope, the Parasiala, Strasala, Kotre, Meneman, and Alisa Rope, the Paro. Rasola prevede sempre la mia porosa nel mato cuore. La mano mato cuore prevede bisca la tua bosca e sala con te le vette là. Hai la cuore prevede bisca la tua scasso le che ne sempre là. Ya la mano cuore. Ehi, lo cala cuore. Yes, Father, and we pray this for every child, every little child, every boy, every girl, every teenager, every young man, every young woman, every, every family, Father, every mother, every father, Lord, every mature person, Father, we pray this for all of us, Father, that our faith may not fail us, but that we will come up in faith. We'll come up in strength, Father. Hallelujah. That we'll have exceeding growing faith and we'll comfort and encourage one another in our faith, Lord. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. And we will comfort and encourage one another with words of love, of only believe. Only believe. Hallelujah. Of only, keep your switch of faith turned on. Keep your eyes on the scriptures. Keep your heart. Keep them in the midst of your heart. Hallelujah. Only believe. Only believe, heritage of faith, people. That's what we are. We are believers. We're not doubters. We're not doubters. We are believers. So thank you, Father, for answering all of, our, all of these wonderful prayers and blessing all the people that have come to pray, faithful prayers. And uh, we love you all so much. And it's been wonderful to be with you in spirit at this time of prayer. And we'll see you again next week. Bye-bye, everybody. Thank you.